Okay, so let's do go do this hacking thing. Do you wish to begin hacking? Sure. Okay, destroy all purple glitches. WASDs, uh, arrows to move, Z, enter, click to shoot. I didn't mean to do that. There we go. DKG dot security dot set threat not high spell threat level one. Nope, nope. Okay. Uh, I think I have to shoot Chica to get to this one. So one, two, three. Legacy dot aft rbt C at robotics open up security equal true. Oh, thank god. I couldn't tell if that was a C or a S O for over a second. Um, I hope this is lined up. Oh, thank god. Legacy dot aft rbtc add new master true. Not supposed to be capital master. True, comma, five, comma, five, master, dot, full, control. Not how I spell control. Aw, oh, come on. Do you wish to begin hacking? Sure. Line this up. Legacy, dot, aft, robotic, add, new, master, true, Comma five, comma five, or five, comma five, comma master dot full control. Oh, thank God! Has anyone told you that you're a natural? I feel like promoting you from just your work here alone. Whoa, really? Well, uh, that was just an expression. I had to talk to the ones in charge. Oh, who's her bosses anyway? Just fast and insane itself. Don't worry though, you're doing great. You're a damn good hacker. The company you work for. They don't care about you. This woman doesn't care about you. She is just using you. No. What makes you so sure? You've been wrong by them so many times in the past. To think this woman would be any different is just foolish. She isn't worth your time. What's stopping this one from going behind your back and reporting about how unqualified you are? She could just be putting on a pretty face. You've only known her for a day. Isn't that funny you'd put so much trust into someone you've only known for a while? We've known each other for much longer, though. That lingering feeling of wanting more in life? Wanting to be somebody? That's me. You just need to follow me. Don't follow him. Jeez, you really get stressed from hacking, huh? I'm over it. Let's just move on. Right. The lingering feeling of wanting more? Is this thing really how I feel? Can I truly trust someone like Marie? I'm so conflicted. I need to keep moving. I need to find this mysterious figure. I think we can trust Marie and not glitch trap is my opinions here um let's see we should try this way now i guess this hopefully we don't run into you know him um okay uh there's an arrow pointing to whatever this is anomaly research 05 heart shaped necklace oh see i was looking at the bust or whatever that is on the right, the like hole in it. A mysterious necklace found in an underground warehouse. This necklace uses redacted tech to shape shift whoever is wearing it. The effect is only temporary. Uh huh. It was seemingly a discarded project that was never used. Hey, this thing says this necklace allows for shape shifting. Shape shifting? No way. Let me try that. Mariel rushed over and grabbed the necklace through the broken glass. Wait, uh, how's it work? I have, I have it on, right? That'd be terrible sticking your arm through broken glass. Like, what if you got cut? Maybe. Try pressing that button inside and try thinking about me. Just think about me a lot. I don't know. Okay. She activated the necklace and... Whoa. Holy shit, dude. Oh, Vanessa now. Oh, her eyes are still blue, though. Hey, my name is Vanessa. I, I like IT stuff and surfing the web and other things. This thing is really powerful. Uh, I'm getting sick. Okay, I'm shutting it off. Here, take it. She handed me the necklace and I quickly turned it on. So, Vanessa, where are we off to now? No way. Do I look okay? This is really weird. Oh, her eyes are purple there instead of green. 
See, I don't think they changed that when they added the new Vanessa design, because old Vanessa had purple eyes. You certainly look like me. You gotta be shitting me. <laughs> well, it's something you'd say. Uh, uh, well, if you wanna be me, you gotta have some pep in your step. Get a little outgoing, you know? Uh, uh okay, I'll try. Um, fuck. I'm there yelling my bosses, uh, a bit. And I'm gonna trip some balls, I mean, I am tripping balls! Oh, uh, okay, a bit too far. I don't think I ever want to hear my voice say those words in sequence, like, ever again. Oh, so it was her voice, too. Also, maybe we should stop. I can't see you look like this anymore. Why? It's kind of fun, I guess. To be as nice as possible, we probably should really isn't doing my figure any favors. Oh, okay. Looks like she's standing the same way, though, to me. Her hair was slightly different colored, too, there, wasn't it? I disabled the necklace and put it back on its display. Let's just leave that there. That technology standard is not ready for the outside world yet. Agreed. Your bond level has increased. Uh, <laughs> number five. So we need to find three more things. I hope I find them all, because I don't want to miss one. I'd go crazy having to search this whole place again. Um, let's try this way. Or did we already go this way? There's something... Uh, well, we went that way. So let's go check the up one, I guess. What are you? This note seems to be some kind of setup for a kind of emergency situation. Most of it seems eligible, but one part interests me. After writing the emergency scan dot start function, you'll have to declare some arguments after it to make it work. You'll have to declare the scan mode. There's a typical virus scan, scan mode dot virus. Then there is scan mode dot anomaly mode, which is less of a virus scan and more so checks for irregularities of the system. It will attempt to remove any ir irregularities. There are two arguments after that. There's a remove privileges argument, setting it to true will remove permission to any unwanted programs. There's also the stealth removal argument, setting it to true lets you scan without any potential viruses or anomalies without them noticing. It should almost always be on. An example code would be dkg.aiproject.emergencyscan.start scan mode.virus, comma vault, comma true. Huh. Wonder how I could use this. Do I have to write this down? I'm gonna write this down. Uh, oh crap. One second. I'll be back in a second. Alright. So I wrote that down just in case I can use it. I know what you desire. Where are we anyway? I can't remember. Um. There's a claw? Uh, this might be circuit or scrap babies. Now let me read. Search 07. Claw. A large claw was found by a vintage Freddy Fazbear's pizza collector initially. Our redacted dating technology suggests this may have belonged to a circus baby animatronic at one point. Is that all? Okay, let's check you, I guess. Oh, those are some trees. Man, after being here so long, I really miss the outdoors. Yeah, it's all musty and weird and gross in here. The killer headache doesn't help either. I don't really have much to do during work, so... Shouldn't you be busy, though? I heard IT is super busy because of all of the work that's been going on recently. I just get the odd jobs, really. They don't give me much to do, and everyone assumes I'm just a slacker. I tried contacting the company about it, but they never gave me a response. Huh. I'll look into it when I get back. A anyway, since I don't have much to do, I'm usually on my computer. I usually just kind of surf the web. It's all I can do without getting flagged by the computers. Anyway. Lewis has caught me a couple times. You know, that's not really the thing you want to be telling a higher up. I, uh, I would be mad, but it's you, and we're stuck here. So, whatever. It's something to talk about. I'd rather you be honest if this is really our final moments. True, but I'd rather not think about that. My point was that I just really, really like... Like what? I look at a bunch of photos of nature, flowers, and cute insects on the web to de-stress. Do you like stuff like that? That was not what I was expecting. I think my favorite is Fluffy Bees. If I could afford a cute little Fluffy Bee plushie, I totally would. It'd be kind of nice. I don't think a plushie is too out of your but is too out of your budget though. I'm still in debt. Maybe I don't know. I'll ask Lewis to get it for you. He would probably wanna. That seems wrong. I don't know if I can accept the gift from Lewis. He's Lewis. True, but he does care for you. You gotta give him some credit. He hides all your red flags from the company. Wait, you knew about this? Kinda. Oh man, the ability to talk about personal details with your superior makes you trust her more. Your bond level has increased. 
We're at six, so there's only two more things. But we only got one more computer, so I don't know what much else there can be. I... I can't. I can't think. I can't think straight. All I see is his face. I... I think I might go insane. I'm losing it. The code. There's a code to fix everything. It's in the DKG.AI project repository. I'm sure of it. I... I'm sure of it. Is that the stuff I wrote down? Maybe? I don't know, honestly. Oh. So, this room is just full of these weird fire alarm things. How quaint. Yeah, nothing too crazy here. Maybe we can start looking for one of those computers to hack. No, hold on. I found a note from one of the employees. A note? Who cares about a random note? I'm sorry, I just thought it was important. If you think it's important, go ahead. To the one who was reading this, please send help. The system, oh. To the one, she's gonna read it, so I'll just read her text. To the one who is reading this, please send help. The system's gone totally haywire. Everything looks like we're in a spinning forward text and people are dying left and right. Some system went haywire. There's this virus and I can't explain. Just know that it isn't good. To anyone reading this, don't panic. The system, it's called the illusion disc, uses high frequency sound to cause hallucinations. I was right. These sounds to me be so damaging, they destro can destroy your entire nervous system. Covering your ears doesn't help. It's an advanced illusion disc we made. Don't even try. Just stay calm. If you let panic take you over, it kills you. God help me, please. If you're reading this, be safe. Huh. Oh my god, so this is what happened to Deck Gun. That's also why we're seeing all this crazy shit. So it really is just an illusion, huh? That's what those things on the wall are. These illusion discs. Kind of scary. Yeah, it's just it's visual, like you said earlier. But at least now we've confirmed that it really is just all in our heads. If we panicked, it could have short-circuited our brain. So, maybe you slapping me in the face when I was about to pass out was a good thing. I could have died on the spot there and then. Oh, um, I guess. If my timeline is right, some kind of virus started controlling the building. Made all these weird illusions and people died from the panic. That's why Decagon just stopped contacting us. But, why? Why did no nobody know that so many people died? This is... this is unreal. It's hard to even process. To think that innocent lives were lost. Whoever is behind this, I'll make them pay. Whatever this virus is, we need to stop it. Delete it somehow. As long as we stay calm, I think we can do it. We need to do it not only for us, but for everyone who used to work here. We can't let anyone else die. True. There's also something else to consider. If we know it's an illusion, can't we just walk out? Even if we can't see the front door, it's still there. Might as well check. Come along for a short trip, okay? We tried to go back to the lobby, but the door from the research core to the lobby was locked shut. We then went back to where we started. So, that was a bust. That door was shut tight. Might be the work of whatever is behind this. Yeah, I don't know if we'll ever get out of here with some reality distorting virus around. Also, where are the bodies? The illusion could be covering that up too. Oh, no. I thought I stepped on something earlier. Was that a body? Saying that, I thought I was going, going to hurl, but I kept it in. Just don't think about it. Remember, don't panic. Oh, okay. Now, let's get back to the task at hand, shall we? Computer, where are you? Uh, yeah, computer, I'll get to it. Just give me a moment. That didn't raise her bond. Sad. I was hoping it would've. Though, who knows. Anyway. So, let's get ready to do this hack, I guess. Oh, uh, well, I should save first. Do you wish to save? Yes. Save the game. <laughs>